day in the life of an electrician uh, changes every day. It depends what you're doing. So I usually get up early in the morning, uh, run to Timmy's, grab your coffee. We start at about 6.30, get all together with all the guys and you go over all the tasks you have for the day, set up who's going where, who's working with who, um, make sure you have all the information you need to start your task. Depending on the weather, it could be cold weather work, hot weather work, inside, outside. Uh, you don't know if you're rigging or pulling wire or running pipe or roughing in BX or finishing off putting switches and lights in. Uh, that can change every day depending on where you're at. We have a couple breaks, usually do a coffee break in the morning and lunch around noon. And then we uh, keep working till the, uh, till the lights come on and then, uh, then we're good for a day, come back, put in another hard day. So it's, uh, it's, a, it's a great environment because you always have different things going on, whether you're in a residential or commercial or industrial environment. It's all pretty much the same kind of hours and setup, and, and uh, you do different tasks depending on where the job is at. Different stages that come through a project. Um, being an electrician is really neat because you get to start off right from ground zero. We're there when they start scraping the dirt off. We get our primary installations in and get the electrical vault going. So we're there right from when they break ground and then we get into the concrete. So as the concrete's going in, we've got conduits running in the concrete and everything there. Then as the building starts to, to form up its shape, we're there roughing in right behind it. The studs go up, the iron goes up, and we follow through with all of our wiring and conduits and uh, follow through with that. Then as we finish our installations and the plumbers and the HVAC guys and the sprinklers and everybody else finishes their installations, they come through and board everything over and uh, all of our hard work gets hidden behind the walls, which no one ever sees again. But uh, with all that important rough-in work, nothing else can happen. So we go through, do our rough-ins, do inspections, close everything up, and then they start finishing. And when we get to that point, we go through and uh, hang all of our light fixtures and devices and plugs and switches and wireless and all that kind of stuff to keep up with the technologies and the needs of people today. And uh, once we're finished wrapping up, they do a big cleanup. We turn all the lights on, test all the power, and uh, building's ready to turn over to the client. It's, it's really rewarding work. When you go to a project and you start off and there's nothing there and you get to stay till this thing is now a full project done and ready to turn over to the client, you say, I did that. I drive around the city with my kids. Hey, daddy was involved in that one. Daddy was involved in that one. I helped build that store. And we go through the stores and they're like, hey, my dad did this. It's really cool to, to have that you know, feeling of accomplishment from something that you've done and, and it's very rewarding to, to be able to see your, the fruits of your labor come to fruition.